some of these young people, they have, um, they have evolved, I think, more than us older folks in that they are very attuned. And I think that some of the most important things with really making a connection with people is to honestly, deeply listen to them. And when I talk about deeply listening, it's like the indigenous um, quality of witnessing, practice of witnessing. So in a conversation, you're to be a witness of the other person, which is to listen with your heart and your ears and your eyes. And what you're doing is you're, you're attuning to that person. And so what I've seen with these lovely young students is they have, they understand that. Somehow they're, I think they're more evolved in their consciousness. And so they realize if they really do, um, are very genuinely interested, authentically interested, then they have that capability. And when someone gives you their undivided attention and you feel, yes, they really are interested in what I have to say, you're going to go a lot deeper, a lot further and get really, really meaningful conversation. So that I think that's a skill that my niece and other young people that I've been working with have. It's also a skill that's part of indigenous culture. Um, the, the deeply listening, the witnessing, and the not speaking for. It's a process you're not to speak for anyone, you're to listen to them. And if anyone's to speak, it's the person who holds the knowledge. So I think this is actually something that some of these um, young researchers in the university are learning that in fact there is a lot to being a good researcher because you are re-looking, re-experiencing uh, and doing it in a very holistic way where it's not just your intellect uh, devoid from the rest of your body. So there's a somatic piece to it too. And there's a quality of allowing a space too for the information to drop into. So it, it's, it's also a capacity of stepping back enough so there is this space for the conversation to drop into and not overcrowding it either. So there's a lot of sensitivity and um, personal awareness, personal integrity involved. And I, I think that that's, that's at, at play when you meet someone like, uh, like my niece.